Hi guys, my name's Rhiannon. I'm orchestra manager for Kaleidoscope Orchestra. We've had an amazing response to our last few videos, which we've uh, done in reaction to uh, the coronavirus crisis that we're going through at the moment. And it's been so amazing to have all of these lovely um, words of encouragement and messages saying that we've cheered people up and put smiles on people's faces. Um, it's really the thing that we're doing this for. So yeah, we just wanted to put together a little video to say thank you. I just saw your piece on BBC Breakfast TV and wanted to let you know that it brought tears of joy to me and my wife. I would love to see and hear more from and about you if you have any appropriate links. Absolutely wonderful. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. Thank you so much, Miles. That is a gorgeous message and it means so much to us when we get these messages. I actually got a bit emotional myself when I saw the first lockdown video to see all the people that I care about so much, the other musicians in the orchestra, us playing together. It was a really special moment. So I really, I'm really pleased that that is transferring to you guys too. So just about where you can find us. So we've got a really cool YouTube channel. You just type in Kaleidoscope Orchestra. You can also find us on Instagram under the same name, Kaleidoscope Orchestra, and also on Twitter, Kaleidoscope Orc. Also, we have a fantastic website where you can buy merchandise, like my awesome t-shirt, hoodies, hats, whatever. Go have a look, check it out. Thanks so much for getting in touch, Miles, again, to you and your lovely wife. Dear Kaleidoscope Orchestra, I'm based in the Netherlands. We're not under lockdown as such, but we are social distancing, and so my 90-year-old gran is mostly in her house alone. I've been bringing her shopping, and this morning I also bought her your entrance video. She absolutely loved it, and immediately went on to check out all your videos on YouTube on her iPad. Thank you so much for putting a smile on my gran's face. I never thought I'd see her vibe to an early 1990s house banger. Big thanks and much love, Renee. Well, thanks so much for your message, Renee. Um, it's just amazing for us to know that we can bring some joy to anyone's day, um, especially by doing what we love. And so we're really glad your gran got to have a boogie to that one. And you know, no one's ever too old to buy about some bangers. And we just look forward to continuing to put a smile on both your faces in the coming months. I saw you on breakfast TV. It's awesome. You brightened up what was going to be a boring day. I love music and appreciate talent, and you guys have plenty of talent. Well done. Nice one, Dennis. Cheers. Got a lovely message from Penny. She said she loved our music this morning and thanks us. Well, thank you, Penny. We do it for people just like you. This one's from Dale Morgan who asks, Hi, what's the best way to see when your future performances will be after all the virus restrictions have finished? Saw you all on BBC Breakfast this morning and it sounded fantastic. Well, thank you very much for that, Dale. We are going to get gigging as soon as we possibly can. We just need to sort of wait for this all to settle. Keep updated with our social media and what's going on with us and we will let you all know as soon as we possibly can. So James says, wow, well done and thank you one and all. Glad you enjoyed it and thanks for supporting us. So the message here from Shivani says, hi guys, just listen to your recent uploads. Don't you worry child and set you free. Thank you for bringing so much joy at a time like this. I've shared with so many friends here and abroad. When this is all over, please come to Bristol or London. Rock on, God bless, Shivani. First of all, Shivani, thank you so much for your message. It means a lot that um, the tracks that we love playing and that we've always loved playing are now bringing so many people such happiness. Um, so thanks for listening and thanks for sharing with your friends. Um, second of all, you asked about a tour. As soon as this is over, we're just so ready to get back playing live. And so thank you for the, your suggestions of Bristol or London as gig venues. If there's anybody else listening who has any other ideas about where we should tour to, either in the UK or internationally, please let us know. We'd love to hear where you all are. And we hope to see you at one of our gigs soon. This is a message from Keith who said, love your online performance this morning on BBC's breakfast programme. I have just downloaded both of your tracks from Amazon. Is there any chance that what you performed on the programme this morning will be available for download? Would love when this mess is over to be able to come to one of your gigs if possible. Keep doing what you do, it is great. Thank you so much Keith for your lovely message. Um, we are looking into releasing the lockdown sessions tracks uh, that you heard, so please stay tuned for that.